Sea spiders lack the presence of any true respiratory structures, such as gills and lungs. Instead, they rely on the diffusion of oxygen directly across their cuticle. Many species of sea spiders are often found colonized with epibionts, which are living organisms growing on the surface. These include barnacles, bryozoans, and algae. Because these epibionts are growing on the surface of the sea spiders, they're likely having a negative influence on the sea spider's gas exchange. To test this, I measured oxygen concentrations at the top of epibionts and also at the bottom of the epibionts or at the surface of the sea spiders. We also tested the effect of epibionts on the host weight and drag. We did this on individual sea spiders, both with and without epibionts. As you can see here, those sea spiders without epibionts fell much slower in the water column and had much less drag. Sea spiders possess a number of mechanisms that they use to prevent the growth or initial attachment of epibionts. For example, many species possess specialized structures called ovigers that they use to slide across their cuticle and dislodge any loosely attaching epibionts. To test how well these ovigers actually keep the cuticle clean, in a number of individuals I tied their ovigers together using string. These individuals with restricted ovigers were placed into a cage along with control sea spiders with unrestricted ovigers and left down in McMurdo Sound for over a month where I will then analyze the growth of epibionts. Other potential mechanisms of epibiont control include the periodic molting of their cuticle thereby getting rid of anything that may have been attached to it. Sea spiders also likely excrete different chemicals or waxes that prevent the initial attachment of epibionts. Here in one species of sea spider, I measured the wettability of their cuticle, which can be used as a proxy for how easy it is for epibionts to attach to it. These experiments allow us to explore the consequences of sea spiders interacting with a diverse community of organisms that are likely influencing their host's respiration and biomechanics.